Authorities trying to get a grip on copycat uh, threats of gun violence in schools across central Alabama. Yeah, nearly a dozen schools have kept officials on their toes since Wednesday when a former student opened fire at a Florida high school, killing 17 people. The latest threat against Bessemer High School. Now, Chief Michael Roper says a parent went to police. Unlike other school systems, Bessemer will be in session tomorrow and there will be extra patrols. In Etowah County, authorities alerted us today about two more threats involving Hoax Bluff High School, one made nearly a month ago and another on Friday. The student who made a threat in January is facing charges. Officials say the two incidents appear to be unrelated. And security will be heightened on Tuesday when Springfield High School students return to class. Authorities arrested a student for allegedly making a threat on social media. It was directed at the school. Right now, the student is in the juvenile justice system. So far, officials haven't said what the threat was, but we expect more details tomorrow. And in Jefferson County, school officials say they are aware of a possible threat on Snapchat against Shades Valley High School. It's unclear who made that threat. Jefferson County deputies and Irondale police are investigating.